me Rabab Zehra from Tech Expedia. We are at Intersec 2025 and I have with me right now Mr. Faisal Israr. He is Sales Manager Enterprise Networks at Corning. Uh, he is with us right now. So let's uh, speak with Faisal and ask him a couple of questions. Hi Faisal, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Thank you for having me here. It's a pleasure to have you here with us. Great, thank you so much. Okay, so Faisal, uh, Corning is here at Intersec. Tell us about the company, what it does and what kind of products and solutions you have. So basically, Corning is an American company uh, in the state of New York. Corning is also name of a of a city within the state of, of New York, about four and a half hours from from Manhattan. A lot of people do not know this. Um, we are a company that was established in the 1870s. So we are a very, very, very old organization, public limited company. Um, we've got four, we've got five divisions, and the division I work with is the optical communications division. What we do is we specialize, we manufacture, we do with a lot of R&D in solutions such as fiber optic solutions, wireless, we've got copper products as well. But Corning is quite well known for glass-based solutions. If you've heard of Pyrex, we are the ones who invented it. If you've heard of Gorilla Glass, we are the ones who've introduced this product to Apple and many other, other customers. So primarily we are a glass based organization and when you look at the fiber optic cables, the core of fiber optic cables is also glass. So we are the largest, if not the largest, or one of the largest fiber optic solutions manufacturer in the world. We've got manufacturing facilities in USA, um, Poland, Turkey, uh, some in India as well and, and Far East as well. That, that's great. Uh, so, um, uh, the regions that you're covering, uh, specifically talking about the UAE and the other regions you're covering, what opportunities do you see there for your products? So, me personally, I'm looking at UAE, Qatar and Afghanistan and occasionally some other territories as well if nobody else is handling it. The kind of opportunities I see in the region, I mean, of course, since we are part of this security event, I must say security. Um, that's that's the biggest application at the moment, whether it's, it's Qatar or, or UAE. This is the biggest right now, or whatever is happening in the in the world. Any CCTV application or or access controls or intrusion detection. Out of three projects, definitely we are there in one of those those three three projects. Uh, I can easily say 35 to 40 percent of the CCTV structured cabling is with Corning Corning product. We are we are selling that almost on a daily basis, whether it's it's day to day business, what we call it as run rate business, or large projects. We are there. Apart from this, um, the buzzword these days is artificial intelligence data centers. We are definitely looking to do more and more of these data centers in the region. We've recently secured some very attractive business uh, when it comes to AI DCs. And this would be probably, I would say, the main focus business for us for next couple of years. So security and AI data centers are the two two key uh, solution sets for us. Okay, so uh, you just talked about uh, the areas where Corning specializes. What are the other segments that you are covering and what opportunities do you see in those segments? Like I said, the, the other areas that have a lot of potential is the telecom business. So security is one, data center is one. This is something I'm personally hand handling as well. Then we've got a complete separate division which handles carrier business. Companies like Etisalat, Du, Oridu, Afghan Telecom, um, PTCL in, in Pakistan, uh, Turkcell in in, uh, in Turkey, and, and many other across the region, we've got very high focus on on these telecom operators as well because end of the day they are the ones who are buying thousands of kilometers of, of fiber optic cables and um, um, solutions as well from us. For example, the world's largest telecom operator AT&T, they are our biggest client and Verizon, similarly STC and the Salat, all of these are our customers. So that is one area and there is one more area which I think where where really um, we've been putting a lot of focus in these areas is the government infrastructure, airport infrastructure, government schools infrastructure. So a lot of things happening in the, in the, in the region where we are almost always, we are there by default. 
that's that's great so one last question from my side we are in industry like 2025 Uh, how is it going for you and what uh, how uh, what uh, what importance intersec holds for cornig as a company so this is the first time cornig is is representing through one of our distribution partners uh, um it was my idea to be part of this this event and i think so far um i was i was right the traction is is great i'm seeing a lot of people a lot of relevant people this is the most important thing i mean of course you get a lot of crowd Correct. but how many relevant people show up that's that's important so we are we are seeing the right crowd and if today is just the first day so we will see a lot more till, till the evening time and the next two days as well so i'm very very excited and uh, i think it's a good good show we would love to be here next year as well that's amazing thank you so much for being here with us vaisal it was thank a pleasure thank you for having me thank you so much Thank you for watching. Stay tuned to Tech Extra to know more about what is happening at Intersect 2025. Goodbye. Tech X, your trusted technology media partner.